Welcome to Market Man, your new ally in efficient inventory management. Today, we'll guide you through the essential setup steps to get you started. Let's begin. When you log into Market Man, you'll see the navigation bar on the left side of your screen. This is your command center for accessing all features. Let's start by setting up your users. Go to Settings, then Manage Users. Click Add to create a new user. There are two user types, managers and employees. Managers have full access to add, edit, or delete inventory items and recipes, while employees have more restricted access, focusing on daily tasks. Managers can set spending limits for employees or require approval for orders, helping control costs while allowing staff to restock as needed. Next, let's set up your suppliers. In the Items and Setup menu, click Suppliers. Here you can add and manage your suppliers. For each supplier, enter their name, default category, like fish or dairy, and provide an order email. You can also set up delivery dates and order reminders. Now, let's organize your inventory with categories. Go to Items and Setup, then Categories. Categories help organize your inventory items, like meat, produce, etc., and are crucial for reports. You can easily add, delete, or edit categories here. Setting up storage areas is next. In Items and Setup, click Storage Areas. These represent physical locations in your restaurant, like freezers or bars. One item can be in multiple storage areas, making inventory counts easier. Finally, let's manage your inventory items. Navigate to Items and Setup, then Inventory Items. Here you can view, add, or edit items. When adding an item, provide its name, category, purchase options, storage areas, and count forms. You can also set minimum on hand quantities and par levels. To save time, you can bulk update items. Use the filters at the top of the page. Select the relevant items. Then click Actions and Bulk Update. Here is the list of all the operations you can perform to save yourself time. You can assign items to categories and storage areas or set up par levels and tax rates. Let's put this into practice. Imagine you're setting up a key ingredient, let's say olive oil. You'd start by ensuring your olive oil supplier is in the system. Then, you'd check if you have a suitable category, perhaps dry goods. Next, you'd confirm you have a storage area set up for this type of item. Finally, you'd add the olive oil as an inventory item, complete with all its details. Remember, thorough setup now will save you time and prevent headaches later. Take the time to input accurate information for your users, suppliers, categories, storage areas, and inventory items. This groundwork will make your day-to-day -day inventory management smooth and efficient. Don't hesitate to explore the other options in the navigation bar. You'll find features for purchasing, recipe management, and insightful reports. As you start using the platform, remember that our support team is available via chat, email, and through the Help Center. Thank you for choosing Market Man. We're excited to be part of your journey towards more effective inventory management.